directional surveys are conducted for several key reasons. It all boils down to simply knowing where the wellbore is. The desired outcome is for the wellbore to be steered to hit a target, which can be over a mile down and more than three miles out from the drilling rig floor. We need to know how deep the drill bit is, what direction it is headed, and repeat that throughout the drilling process. That is what an MWD survey helps us do. Specialized tools are used in drilling operations to measure and execute the well plan. These measurements are often taken using an MWD surveying tool and therefore referred to as MWD surveys. So, what is an MWD survey? An MWD survey has three parts, measured depth, inclination, and azimuth. A series of these MWD surveys along the well path are used to determine its location, which again are measured depth, inclination, and azimuth. But what are these three measurements? Measured depth is the total distance along the hole to the MWD tool. This is determined from the driller's pipe tally, literally measuring the sections of drill pipe that were drilled into the ground and adding them all up. Inclination is the angle from vertical to the MWD tool. The accelerometer sensors are used to determine inclination. Inclination ranges from zero degrees to 180 degrees, where zero degrees inclination is oriented vertically down. 90 degrees inclination is oriented horizontally and 180 degrees is oriented directly up. Azimuth is the bearing direction from north to the projection of the survey point in the horizontal plane. Because the survey point is being projected in the horizontal plane, the calculation of azimuth relies on both the magnetometer and the accelerometer sensor measurements. Azimuth ranges from zero degrees to 360 degrees, with zero and 360 degrees corresponding to north, 90 degrees to east, 180 degrees to south, and 270 degrees to west. Again, the MWD surveys along the well path lead to determination of its position, with the goal being to position the well according to its well plan. The typical MWD survey procedure is a survey every 100 feet in straight hole sections and every 30 to 45 feet in sections with large orientation changes, such as the curve section of a well. So what does an MWD survey tell us? An MWD survey tells us the orientation from vertical and from the magnetic north of the MWD tool. From there, the survey can be converted to the appropriate north reference and used to calculate the position of the well in conjunction with the other surveys. The takeaway is that the wellbore's position is calculated based upon the surveys. And any error in the survey measurement will cause error in the positional calculation of the well path. Understand that any MWD survey measurement will have measurement error associated with it. Realistically, it is impossible to have a perfect measurement. It is the industry standard to compute the well path location from the MWD survey measurements using a process called minimum curvature. The baseline accuracy of the positional calculation of the well path is only as good as the inputs used to feed the calculation. The saying 
your wellbore is only as good as your surveys is a result of this measurement and calculation dependence. Contact HMP Survey Management to learn more.